where we got together with the community was looking at the battlefield. And as you know, um, it was the experts, including me, who thought the battlefield was somewhere else. And it was the community who were actually telling us, no, we think it's in Sesha, um, cleanish sort of area. So I think it was a really good example of how a community led the archaeologists and said, look, okay, you do your thing, but you have to do it in where we want it. Uh, so much so that uh, Morris Owens was able to take me to a field. I think you were there that day as well. And he took us down to a field down at the Ford, the actual Ford of the Biscuits. And he said to me, I think, as I remember anyway, I've always been told this is the Ford of the Biscuits and this is where the battle was. So we said, right, we'll listen to Morris. And we started looking there. And I would think it was probably two minutes later we started finding evidence of the battle. Because that doesn't happen in archaeology. You know, in archaeology, you research for months, if not years. You do a dig, and maybe you do it over six weeks, and the last day of the dig you find something small. We find it within two minutes, so it was great. Not only did we rewrite history by moving the site of the battle, and the site of the battle was meant to be about a mile, three miles away at the most, to the east. We've moved that and found it was actually at a different place. But even more than that, we find that some of the battlefield artefacts we find show that the Irish tactics were actually very advanced. And we sort of know that in general, but we find little bullets called slugs or plugs that traditionally are meant to have appeared later in Europe. But we find them in 1594 now in Fermanagh, right at the start of this war between the Gaelic Lords and the English Crown that the tactics the, the Gaelic Lords were using were the same tactics really that had been used by the Spanish army and the English armies and the continent. Um, so it's really advanced stuff. Um, and that was amazing. And um, we're pushing dates back, we're, we're changing ideas. We really are making history there.